Hey all, welcome to Zero One Byte. It's July 20, 2025, and time is 6 p.m. IST. And here are the top tech news updates so far today. On August 2, 2027, there will be a total solar eclipse that will last over 6 minutes and 23 seconds. You'll be able to see it in parts of Europe, North Africa, and Middle East. But sadly, you can't able to witness this from India because this thing happening on the other side of the globe. Maybe you can see partially about few seconds from India. If you are lucky, this will be the longest eclipse on land in 100 years. However, according to the space.com, the upcoming eclipse breaks the norm, making it the longest total solar eclipse visible from the land between 1991 and 2114. If you love space or sky events, don't miss this one. It's super rare. Next, if you use a Mac and you have ChatGPT Plus, good news. There's a new record mode feature. Now you can record your meetings or voice notes and ChatGPT will turn them into a summary for you. No more writing down notes or forgotten what was told in Teams meeting. This was only for big companies before, but now it's available to anyone with Plus on Mac. It's super useful for work or school, but it requires subscription to ChatGPT Plus. Next, first AI malware found at its call Lemmy Hub. This is scary. It's using Alibaba's AI models, the same tech behind chatbots. But these Lemmy Hub can infect Windows PCs, discovered by Ukrainian cyber experts. It's linked to Russian hacker group and spreads through zip files. It even uses hugging face APIs to run shady commands, all driven by an AI brain. We are officially in the AI cyber war era. Stay careful when opening unknown files. Make sure you always use trusted sources to get files or anything. Even though if you are using a trusted file source, Make sure the file was clean or not by using total virus scan or 360 scan anything because no one in this world are giving you free stuff. They may be show ads or put ransomware or virus or adware to push some revenue to them so that they can sustain their websites or tools in a better way like all Play Store apps do like pushing advertisements. All right, crypto fans, listen up. President Trump just signed a new law called Genius. This is the first big rule book for stablecoins in United States. Stablecoins are a kind of digital money which resembles the value of United States dollar or similar to that. Unlike Bitcoin, stablecoins don't swing in price. The law says they now must be backed by real US dollar or short term treasury bonds and report their results every month to them. This will help the United dollar stay strong in the world. Because US has about 37 trillion dollars in debt. If they can adopt digital currency as base of US dollar backed by these so called uh, cryptocurrencies backed by US dollar, then they can achieve their future goals in crypto market and they can gain some stuff in Bitcoin or other assets what they're holding right now. So they know Bitcoin has value, potential. To grow so they are investing in bitcoin but investing in bitcoin or cryptocurrency is not advisable a coin can go up 10,000 percentage and a coin can collapse like 99.9 percentage example luna and recent home so be cautious with crypto always do research then investing in crypto markets good news android phones can warn about earthquakes this is amazing google's android phones have a hidden talent they can act like mini earthquake detectors. Their earthquake alert system taps into data from billions of phones to sense thermos before you can feel them. It's cheap, effective, and doesn't even need any fancy equipment. Science says it's like an early warning system right in your pocket. Technology can be amazing sometimes. Next, let's talk about sugar-free substitute called erythritol. It's used in sugar-free snacks like protein bars, diet sodas, healthy ice creams, and keto treats. A new study from the University of Colorado found that erythritol might not be healthy after all. It could damage brain vessels, increase the inflammation, and raise your stroke risk. So just a reminder, even sugar-free isn't always safe. If you are trying to be healthy, avoid sugar, even if it's artificial or natural avoid at all cost thanks for watching zero one bite follow for more daily tech updates have a great day